Just watch me break in your sweat. You're falling into me, touch me. I swear, you would do anything that I want. So keep us awake till the dawn. Ooh, baby. Samantha, pass me the ball. I'm open. I can't believe I've been benched this entire period. This class is gonna bring my GPA down. Cinnamon, cover for me. I'm gonna try to get the ball. <laughs> Cinnamon. Oh, thank God. Hey, Cinnamon, I'm here to pick you up. It's time for cheer practice. Coming. Let me just quickly change. Great game. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> Is it just me or Cinnamon Strawberry not talking? Who cares? Who wants to be friends with Cinnamon anyways? I'm just saying. Give it to me! Everyone already left. We're gonna be late for math class. Give it to me! Cinnamon, why are you ignoring me? And how did you change the class? Cinnamon, are you mad at me? Do you hear something, Rhubarb? Yeah. Strawberry. Oh, no I don't, but I do smell cat food. Smells delicious, pork and beans. You're disgusting. You're doing 20 more laps doing chair practice. Oh, I don't want to. Look, I really don't know what I did, but like, can you just like talk to me? Rhubarb, hmm. tell that thing over there she's off the cheerleading team. Oh, you just told her. Do it. You're off. The cheerleading team, Strawberry. Why are you kidding me right now? And you have been promoted to assistant to the captain. <gasps> I've wanted that position for so long. It's amazing. Rayworm can't even do a cartwheel. Wait, what's assistant to the captain? Ugh, do I have to do more laps? Absolutely. Uh, I don't want it. Why? Because you and Rayworm. I don't want to hear it. She hates you. I have an idea. Grab the cheerleading outfit from her. Okay. No, no, no. <laughs> Thanks, Rhubarb. Hey, Bertha. You're in. Gladys, a cheerleader. It's Gladys. We have cheer practice Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays. What the heck, Gladys? You tried out for the cheerleading team and didn't tell me? Sneaky. I didn't. I don't understand. Who cares? We're popular now. Well, um, actually, I am popular now. You're not on the cheerleading team. Really? <gasps> hey. Ow. By the way, I'm having a party tonight. Everyone's invited. Except us. Even you, Tootsie and Rhea. What? Losers. I don't know why they're invited. What time should I be there? Really? Yes. Strawberry, you're not invited. What? That is so embarrassing. Let's go. I wonder why Strawberry's not invited to Cinnamon's party. Who cares, Rhea? For once, we're not the most hated by Cinnamon. I don't have to be chased by the guard dogs and security trying to sneak into her party. I knew this day would come. I'm gonna get a bikini wax. What the actual is going on? Did she find out about my secret YouTube channel? Oh. Anyways, I gotta go be popular now. Bye. Did I just lose my best friend? Hmm. She is. She wants to ruin my life. No, no, no. I'm a strawberry. I'm gonna ruin her life. <sighs> Just wait till I tell everyone that she lasers her mustache and that her butt is fake. Well, actually, I don't really know if her butt is fake, but it's fine. I'm gonna tell everyone that it is. Somebody? Huh? Mm. <laughs> Russia, what are you doing in my house? This is not the time for visitors. Your sister let me in. She actually pointed me to her room. 
But luckily I know where your room is. I wanted to drop off your homework before I go to Cinnamon's party. Ugh, don't say that name in this house. Are you okay? No, I am not okay, Raja. Cinnamon has completely lost her mind. First she starts ignoring me, then she takes away my cheerleading outfit, and now she's having a party and doesn't invite me, but invites Tootsie and Rhea? Like, are you kidding me? Can I be honest with you, Strawberry? Cinnamon has the right to be upset with you. <laughs> you know my reflexes are slow. How could you? Don't ever take her side again. I did nothing. Cinnamon told Rubab and Rubab told me. So I'm going to tell you. Cinnamon knows you hooked up with her ex-boyfriend, Daniel. <laughs> and I've always had my suspicions. You have always wanted to ruin her life. And what better way than hooking up with Daniel? What? She said she overheard you at the magic show. I won't tell anyone the secret that you're thinking about right now. That I hooked up with Cinnamon's ex, Daniel. Strawberry, I know you like to hook up with a lot of people, but it is not safe. Don't you pay attention in health class? And why Cinnamon's ex? Well, for starters, I've hooked up with like everyone else. Not me. Are you offering to hook up with me, Raja? I'm not like I haven't thought about it. You? No. Right. Well, Daniel was like the only person I haven't hooked up with yet at BBH. Minus the nerds. Plus he's Cinnamon's ex, so that was a total bonus. But it was legit in the moment. I never thought about it beforehand. It all started a couple of weeks ago. After school, I was just minding my own business like always. Hey, Kristen, get a room. So disgusting I see you making out with Oliver. Mind your business. Uh, rude. And Oliver, you're a pig. Why didn't you call me back last week? Shut up. Uh, rude times too. And that's when I saw Daniel looking like a snack. It's been a while since Trump's got any action, so I decided to make my move. Hey, Daniel. Come here! Hey! Hey, Daniel. What are you doing? Nothing. You? Nothing. <laughs> Yet. Strawberry, get to the point! This story is taking way too long! Oh yeah, sorry. Where was I? So like, what are you doing tonight? No plans. Nice. Wanna like... <laughs> hook up. What about Cinnamon? What about her? Who cares? Sure. No way, really? How? <laughs> yeah, I've got nothing else to do. Oh my god, this is so exciting. You know what this feels like? You know like when you know you shouldn't have carbs, but you want carbs because it tastes so good, and then when you finally eat the carbs, you realize what you've been missing this entire time, but you can't help it because it's so bad. You're the carbs, and cinnamon is the veggies, and no one wants the veggies, <laughs> but sometimes you just want to be bad. Huh? Never mind. Be at my house at 7. My parents and my sister will be out, so we'll have the entire place to ourselves. <laughs> and don't shave. And then he just came over without any hesitation? Yeah. Smile. Whoa, what was that for? Delete it! Don't worry. Those are for my eyes only. Snapchat private story. <laughs> this is so bad, isn't it? Yeah. But I just can't help myself. You're so yummy in my tummy. Why do you say such weird things? Sorry. I don't know, it's just been really tough with this whole heartbreak thing. First cinnamon and candy. <laughs> Let me fix your heart with my big booty and my juicy, juicy lips. <laughs> Oh, we're so bad. Yeah, maybe we shouldn't. Or maybe we should. <laughs> Too much information, Strawberry. Oh, it was so hot. And how could you? You're not even married. 
So yeah, that's what happened. That's how me and Daniel hooked up. It wasn't intentional. Well, not entirely. Maybe you should apologize to Cinnamon. Apologize? Yes, I'm going to the party now. Come with me and apologize. I'm sure she will forgive you. Yeah, yeah. Make her believe that I'm sorry so she makes me cheerleader again, becomes my friend, and then I'll be right back on track to ruining her life and becoming the new queen of BBH. <laughs> That is not what I mean. You're a genius, Raja. Let me just quickly go get dressed. I will wait outside. No, it's okay. Strawberry! Ah! Woo! Hey, what's your style? What you drinking? What's your vibe? I've been feeling rather sad in the corner of my class. Boy, what's your style? What you wow, this house is bigger than the Walmart. Dad, I asked you to drive us. Why did you have to come inside? You guys are such users. I am not your chauffeur. Okay, I'm sorry. Thanks, bye. Does she have open bar? Oh, oh. we're underage. <laughs> oh, I forgot. Hey, food. Oh. Thank God he is not my dad. I don't know where my dad is. I still can't believe that you've become a cheerleader, Lucky. I know, it's crazy. Four guys already asked me out today. I'm a hot commodity. <laughs> wow. Do you know how to kiss? What? I feel like since I'm a cheerleader now, I should know how to hook up with people, right? One time I walked into my brother and his girlfriend kissing. So much tongue, saliva everywhere. Try that. I also suggest taking a mint. <gasps> oh, yeah, you're right. What takes you so long to get ready? It takes a long time to look this hot. Hmm. Everybody is staring at you. What? Mind your own businesses. Go find Cinnamon and say sorry. Where is she? <gasps> Excuse me, Strawberry. You are not allowed to be here. Do you ever just think for yourself, Rhubarb? Or are you always just a puppet? You know Cinnamon thinks you're stupid, right? I am stupid. Stupid? <sighs> and how dare you? I'm gonna tell her what you said. Security! Security! <gasps> I should help her. That is very juicy. Oh, she is not going to like this. Who added me in this group? Cinnamon just throws the fanciest and classiest parties with all her exotic cuisines. Mm -hmm. What is everyone doing with their technological rectangles? Are we missing something? Probably. Strawberry got kicked off the cheerleading team because she's pregnant. <gasps> I heard that too with that really stinky nerd from science class. Their kids would be so stinky because it's genetic. Hey, could that be true, Jeannie? We are identical twins and you are stinky and I'm normal. Oh, that's true. I guess it's not genetic. It's a preference. Yeah. Hey, Kenny and Lenny. Huh? It's Jenny and Penny. Whatever. You better shut your mouth before I shove a stack of hay in there and permanently shut it for you. We are not scared of you, loser. No, we are. We are scared of her. No, Jenny. We are more popular than her. Oh, that's true. Popularity is fun, loser. <laughs> hey, Strawberry. Rumor on the block is that you're off the cheerleading team. You're so lame the mathletes don't even want you. And you have a thing for Raja? 
Well, rumor on the other block is that you've been hooking up with the clarinet player. False. I'm hooking up with the clarinetist and the trombone player. Ugh, that gingerbread. I probably shouldn't eat this since I'm a cheerleader now. Nice outfit. Thanks. I don't know what Strawberry did to Cinnamon, but she's really mad. So Strawberry's no longer a cheerleader. Her spot is mine. <gasps> what is happening to me? Where's Cinnamon? She's probably in her bedroom. Mom, I told you I'll clean my room when I get home. Leave my bras on the floor. Dad, what the heck are you still doing here? Don't be rude. If I am not here, I have to be at home eating your mother's disgusting food. Where are you going? Huh? What happened? No one can know about this. Why do you care so much? Because it's humiliating. My ex-boyfriend and my best friend hooking up? Where is the loyalty? Loyalty stopped being a thing when you and I broke up. I owe you nothing. You at least owe me respect. And why is that? Because I can ruin you. Are you forgetting who I am? My status and my wealth? Maybe that's your problem. You think that your wealth and your status is what makes you a good person? When the truth is, you suck as a person. <sighs> You're a conniving, manipulative little daddy's girl. But that doesn't mean that I stopped thinking about you. What did you say? I still... You still what? I still love... Can we talk? No, absolutely not. Hi, Daniel. Ugh, get a room. This looks more like a you problem than an us problem. I'm out. Ugh. Ugh. What do you want? I'm sorry, Cinnamon. Look, it was never my intention to hurt you. If I could take it back, I would, but I can't. So the only thing we can do is, you know, be best friends and move forward. Besides, he wasn't even that good. You're right, he wasn't. Chat's better. I wouldn't know. It hurts, Strobs. What's the point of girl code if you can't even follow the rules? You're right, never again, friends. Friends. <laughs> I'm so glad that we're friends again. And don't worry, Strawberry. I totally forgive you for punching me in the face and calling me Cinnamon's puppet. What? She's crazy. Totally lost her mind. She's no idea what she's talking about. Probably all that carb going straight to her head. Probably. Anyways, I have to go downstairs and take Bertha's cheerleading outfit away from her. She sucks. Worse than you, which is surprising. I'll be right over, just gotta use the bathroom to tinkle. That was a close one. Now that I have Cinnamon's trust again, what dirt can I find in her room? Her diary, perfect. <laughs>